10 Creative Ways to Use the Depth Map Today's video is sponsored by Joe Rogan. Duplicate your clip. With the second one selected, go to the color page. Bring the depth map to your node. Check the invert box. Activate the map level adjustment box and move the far and near sliders until your subject is black enough. Go back to the edit page, render it in place and delete it from the timeline. Make your first clip a new fusion clip and open the fusion page. Bring your black and white clip in the flow. Add a bitmap node in empty space and connect your clip to the yellow point of the bitmap. Change the channel to luminance and now you can use this as a mask in every effect that you will add, so I will not say it every time. Add a lens blur effect. Right click to the blur size and select to modify with shake. Go to the modifiers tab, decrease the smoothness slider and increase the maximum to 10. Connect the bitmap as a mask to the effect. Add a transform node and change the edges to mirror. Right click to the center value and modify it with shake. Go to the modifiers tab and bring down the smoothness slider. Set the minimum to 0.4 and the maximum to 0.6. Back to the tools tab in the setting menu, activate the motion blur box and increase the shutter angle and the quality. Bring a flicker addition node. Change the type to flick again. Increase the range, adjust the speed to your liking and uncheck one color channel. For every effect, you can go to the settings menu and animate the blend slider if you want. Add a glow node. Decrease the shine threshold and the spread to your liking. Right click in the gain slider and modify it with shake. Go to the modifiers tab and bring down the smoothness slider. Add an analog damage effect and change the preset to security camera. Use a displace node. Bring a fast noise and connect it to the green point of the displace. Adjust the noise sliders to your liking and select the displace node. Increase the refraction strength and the spread slider. Go to the settings tab and uncheck one color channel. If you want, you can also modify the center value with shake. Bring a JPEG damage node. Adjust the resolution and quality sliders to your liking. Add a duplicate node. Change the copies to 5 and increase the size slider. Bring down the blend to 0.5, go to the jitter tab and move the center value. Use a dent node. Change it to type 2 and adjust the size and the strength sliders to your liking. You can combine this effect with the glow also and connect the mask to both of them. Bring a mirror node. Change the placement to kaleidoscope. Adjust the center size to your liking. Right click to the angle slider and select to modify it with anim curves. Go to the modifiers tab, change the source to duration, the curve to easing and the in and out to sign. Combine some effects or animate the blend slider to get different results. If you liked this clip, subscribe to this channel. If you didn't, you are a flat earther.